Hello and welcome. My name is Joey No One and this is Jurassic World Evolution 2. And today I want to show you some basic rules for challenge mode. Some stuff that confuses me at the beginning, but now I'm aware of them and I want to show you my I know want to share my knowledge with you. So, let's start with the um dinosaurs um or maybe the science um, I want to show you and well this one has to lower rate maybe like where is the this oh yeah 13 that's good so for example now we need um, a chemistry of 13 and as we want to know okay uh, we have Rafik who has a chemistry of 10 uh, this one has a chemistry of 6 and like here three five three ten one and when we uh, sort them by the chemistry go right uh, with a button or just with the joystick and then the game will sort them um, from the abilities so uh, if you go here or like this one or this um, the highest rate is always um, at the top so um, yeah, maybe take a much lower dinosaur to evolve this one. Uh, one to three, and then this is my next tip. Um, so you can uh, choose all four by uh, their own, or you just press, as you can see at the top, select all triangle, or it's a Y on Xbox, and then you can select all four of them just by pressing one button. And let's breed those dinosaurs to one. This was quick. And now you can release them with X or you can uh, release them via airlift. And in challenge mode, um, it's always a thing to save money. So when you have to build just one hatchery, it's better than uh, place a hatchery in each of uh, all of your uh, enclosures so just place one don't build a fence around it and just work with the um, airlift the second one is uh, making the guests happy um, you have a transport rate that you uh, try to get high and there are two ways to do this the first thing is to uh, replace the standard path into the biggest the main path so just go like this in all of your park and the transport rate will go up higher or you can do it with the monorail Oops, there he is um, so you place a monorail anywhere uh, uh, at the at the beginning of your park and then a second one at the middle a third one at the end and then you also can um, put up your rate uh, your transport rate higher and the next one is also for the guests so where Hi. do I have to place my today. restrooms and stop talking about. Claire don't interrupt me when I'm telling something. Uh, where is it? Settings, audio, voice. Like that. Go back, go back, go back. So now she's quiet. Uh, where was I? A restroom. Right. So when you place a restroom, uh, maybe still wait till the dinosaurs are there. Are there guests here? Oh yeah, there are the first guests. And um, why isn't ah now it's red? So as you can see now, the red ones, uh, the, the the red path is where the restrooms should be. And don't put it here at the beginning. So uh, I show you what happened then. Maybe the path isn't very too long, but. Normally, this would be like green, 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 green. And this last part, this will be red. Yeah, see, right. And so this is uh, not the perfect place to uh, place a restroom. Uh, so we can replace it like maybe more, maybe more here. And then we also 
put it more in the middle because then we uh, have more green um, place or green path uh, for the restroom, as you can see here. And uh, what was that? Okay. And the same works with the, uh, nope, not the decorations, uh, the shelters. And there they are, just maybe like this one. And we can place this also right here in the middle. And then, as you see, there, it's all green. And the same goes for uh, the amenity. So uh, when you place them here, or maybe more like here, um, the perfect place for those three uh, will be like maybe here, the next one here, and the gift section, the gift shop will be here. Um, to choose betwe between those uh, three, uh, you also can go left and right before you place the building. So when you go like this, right. now we have our restaurant. Uh, not so perfectly, uh, also goes for the uh, drink place and our gift shop. So when we, maybe we use the bigger ones, uh, it will go like, right, just put them down and then we take the bigger ones like this one one two three place it here i just placed some uh place just one to show you guys so now as you can see all blue and this is how the past uh, the uh, guest section works but what does it mean for your um, for your challenge mode part? So don't try to um, make some beautiful path designs or something. Just go uh, very um, simple. And like when I do like this one, as you can see now, this is red because all the guests are now going directly from here to the viewing gallery. So the complete right part uh, doesn't matter to, to the guests um, because they are going straight to the viewing gallery. And um, when you work with uh, the square um, uh, 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 enclosures, <laughs> that was the word I'm looking for, uh, you can go with your path, maybe like, uh, no, that was stupid going like here and just going around it. So you can put it, uh, just going easy here, simple, like this, like this, and connect it here. And when you now have a, another enclosure here, just going like here, there's another big enclosure, blah, blah. And, um, <laughs> And then the guests will also take those two paths uh, to ways to go up here. So then you can place your um, guests' buildings all uh, here next to the path. So like here and here, and then you have the perfect, um, for perfect place for your guests' buildings. And yeah, that's actually it maybe one last small tip from my side uh, when you placed a path and you want to place a um, fence very next to it or very close next to it um, just put it here and as you can see it will snap when you go in the right uh, in the same direction as the path so it snaps here and then you have the perfect um, the perfect placed fence well that's it uh i hope i can help you with uh my small with my short video and if you like my videos please leave a uh, a like <laughs> uh, if you like my videos please leave a like 
and maybe subscribe to the channel so we can see us in my next videos. Have a great time. See you then. Bye.